what's up? And I want to thank 50 Cent for jumping on my timeline. And I'm like, well, what is he doing on my timeline? But that's 50. 50 Cent decides that it would be the greatest thing in the world to do was to go ahead and jump my timeline and talk about the Tim Thomas and Kenya Martin beef, which happens to be one of the stupidest beefs in the history of mankind. This thing is over a decade old. That's how bad it is. It's dumb. It doesn't make any sense whatsoever. And I'm like, this was back when he was with the, uh, this goes back to when he was with the Knicks, when Tim Thomas was with the Knicks. He got fouled by Jason Collins. And then Thomas left on a stretcher, or, well, they ain't take him out on a stretcher, but he got carried out by, by the rest of the teammates back to the locker room. And Kenya Martin, the person who didn't foul him, was basically saying he was faking. Like, wow, oh, man, that dude faking. Man. Like, like, why are we here? This guy ain't doing nothing but faking. Now, with that being said, saying that the guy was faking and this and that, it led to a lot of problems. And when Tim Thomas got out the hospital, you know, the first thing he wanted to do was talk about Kenya Martin. Man, Martin is fugazi. <laughs> so that started this whole thing where they go on the war on the podcast, talking about each other, <coughs> and neither one of them wanted to bag down. <coughs> then they was in New York. They had a fight. Well, not what y'all would call a fight, but a war of words, basically, when they was in New York. When uh, they came back there and they got to talking again. And it was the same thing with Tim Thomas played with the Bulls. He kept bringing it up. You know, look, this is a situation in which it's not going to get better by these two being around each other. They just need to not be around each other because for some reason, Tim Thomas is the one that won't let this go. Like, it ain't Martin. But Martin is not the backing down type person. You know. So they had some words when they was in the New York club. And then uh, Martin had left. And then, um, what happened? They had it, got into it when they was in, uh, the, in Dallas. And this is like Kenya Martin's, you know, he got his guys with him then. Kenya Martin was a little bit more abrasive <laughs> than he should have been. So, Tim Thomas is like, oh, okay, you got the numbers right now. Now you want to pop like you, like you hot. So, Tim Thomas didn't back down, of course. Called him the B word. Called him every word in the book. So Tim Thomas and one of Kenya Martin's buddies is about to get into it. And then cooler heads prevailed. And Tim Thomas is like, I'm leaving because I'm ready to leave. Not because y'all made me leave. So the next time, like, they ran into each other again. Tim Thomas, because uh, Kenya Martin told him he was broke. He took $1,500, Tim Thomas did, in cash, and slapped Kenya Martin across the face. And that's where it was finna go down. Now, besides all that, Al Harrington tried to get these dudes to be cool with each other. You know, he's from Jersey, too. Him and Tim Thomas know each other. They from Patterson, which they call Pakistan. All right? Everybody knows this. Tim Thomas 
has challenged Kenya Martin to a fist fight. Then they said, no, don't do that. The NBA will frown on you. You won't be invited into anything anymore. And they basically don't invite you to nothing anymore now because of this. So Tim Thomas said, all right, no, we're going to turn that to a fight for charity. So Tim Thomas has been on podcasts trying to initiate some type of uh, charity boxing. And this has been going on for a while now. So 50 Cent and them got wind of this, that these two want to fight each other. So they was like, look, let's put that fight on. We got some NBA beef that they can go ahead and take care of. And, you know, and they can go ahead and get that thing squashed. But now, since 50 Cent brought all this up, everybody's like, Carcino, where's the truth behind that beef? I'm like, man, that was something that would come down the road because... It was nothing major until now he brought it up. And I'm like, man, I'm going to have to make this video now. <laughs> this was not over a girl. This was not over anything but foolish male pride and ego. No, Neither man wanting to back down to the other man. And Tim Thomas does not want to let it go. He want to fist fight. Period. He wants to throw hands with Kenya Martin. But Kenya Martin, like, look, dude, I'm not finna talk to you no more. It's gonna get to a point where there ain't gonna be no talking. And Tim Thompson's like, what you talking about, bro? I'm from Pakistan. <laughs> That's what they call Pete Patterson if I didn't say it earlier in New Jersey for some stupid reason. But that's Jersey, you know. It's a hard place to understand. Now with that being said, I'm out. Enjoy the videos. Don't forget to subscribe. Follow the playlist with Sports Beef, the truth behind Sports Beef. And I'm out. That's what that little ring means, that little text. All right.